Hello and welcome to Aleem Academy. The question is a moon cake with two egg yolks cost two dollars more than a moon cake with one egg yolk. Okay, so the cost of six moon cakes with the two egg yolks and five moon cakes with one egg yolk is this. Find the cost of a moon cake with two egg yolks. So let's read the question again. A moon cake with two egg yolks cost two dollars more. Then a moon cake with one egg yolk. Let's suppose the moon cake with one egg yolk cost X dollars. Then the cost of moon cake with two egg yolks will be X plus two. Then what happens? The cost of six moon cakes with two egg yolks and five moon cakes with one egg yolk is this. Is means is equal to. Okay. Find the cost of moon cake with two egg yolks. So let's start the solution now. First of all, we assume. That let the cost cost of moon cake with one egg yolk that is equal to x. This is basically x dollars. Okay, so we can write dollars here as well. We should write dollars here. Okay, so now uh, then then what will happen? Then the cost of moon cake with 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 two egg yolks, two egg yolks. So that will be what? That will be x plus two, x plus two dollars. All right, you got it. So now what happens? Now the we have to follow the statement given in the question, and to follow that, before follow that, we need to write. That according to the given statement in the question, we have what we have. We have to follow the statement. See what we need to follow: the cost of six moon cakes with two egg yolks. Six moon cakes with two egg yolks. See, uh, six moon cakes with two egg yolks. Uh, one moon cake with two egg yolks cost x plus two. So six moon cakes with two x yolk will cost six multiply x plus two or six into x plus two. All right, and and what what is next? The cost of six moon cake, uh, six moon cakes with two egg yolks, and and mean addition. Okay, this and means plus, and five moon cakes with one egg yolk. Okay. Five moon cakes with one egg yolk. C plus five moon cakes with one egg yolk. One egg yolk. The cost of one moon cake with one egg yolk is x. So five moon cakes with one egg yolk will be five into x. All right, five multiply x. That is equal to. This means is equal to how much? One thirty point eight zero dollars. So we got the equation. So now we solve it. Multiply six into inside with x plus two, we get as six x plus six to the twelve, and then five multiply x will become five x is equal to one thirty point eight zero dollars. Everything is in dollars, so we do not need to write dollars. If there will be difference, it will be if there will be a difference, like some things uh, are in cents and some things are in dollars, then we need to. To convert them before writing, but here everything is in dollars, so we just write them. We do not need to convert anything. Okay, so six x plus five x, six x plus five x becomes eleven x. Eleven x plus twelve equals one thirty point eight. So twelve uh, uh, will come on this side. And it will be one thirty point eight minus twelve. So now here we need to use the calculator. So one thirty point eight zero minus twelve is equal to one one eight point eight. So this is equal to one one eight point eight. So now we need to find x. So what? What we will do? We will divide x on both sides. So x will be divided here, and it will be 11.8 over x. 
so now again we need to use the calculator 11.8 is divided sorry sorry 118.8 is divided with 11 and we are getting the answer as 10.8 this is 10.8 okay so what is x basically what is x x is the cost of moon cake with the with one egg yolk okay so what we have to find we have to find the cost of moon cake with two egg yolks the cost of moon cake with two egg yolks is this okay so we have to find this so what we write here the we write here the cost of moon cake with two x yolks is this so in the very next step you can put the values so here put the values and uh, it will become uh, in place of x you can write 10.8 10.8 plus 2 so by calculation we get the answer as uh, 12.8 so uh 12.8 is uh your answer so 12.8 is your final answer for this question and thank you very much for your time stay blessed